my, my only joke the entire time uh, was when I accidentally ran into a performer because I was not paying attention to where I was going. Uh, but no, that's just, that's just a personal experience for me. Uh, Dominic had a few frights. The other two got absolutely bullied by the performers for some reason. <laughs> Um, and to add to it, uh, Dominic actually got flirted on multiple times by multiple performers. Woo! Uh, we counted four, <laughs> but my personal favorite is, uh, well, he, he vapes. Uh, it's a very fruity vape. Uh, and one of the performers came up and just said, you smell fruity. <laughs> and Dominic, of course, rightfully replied, I am fruity. <laughs> and so the performer in turn went, I like that. And then just left. <laughs> and I thought that was perfect. Uh, one guy just desperately asked me for a bone. Um, I was like, me too, dude. Anyway, so the entire time, these people were just absolutely terrified. Because it is a very scary experience. It's like an hour and a half of just being scared out of your mind for everyone else. They were terrified. They were like, oh, God, oh, God, oh, God. And I was like... <laughs> this is true. You can prove, like, I have evidence here, right? So that entire time, I was, like, mesmerized. And that, that's because, like, they had some, they had, like, a wide variety of things that people are scared of there. They had loads of bugs. They had, uh, like, scary dolls, uh, police officers, clowns, uh, dubstep. <laughs> Uh, but they never had any of the fears that really hit home for me. Uh, I think what would have made it a truly scary experience is if, like, just at the end as we're getting out, if Dominic turned and looked right at me and said, you know, I'm just not feeling it anymore. Oh, <laughs> Word. <laughs> I have an intense fear of rejection. That's the joke. 